Greetings. Welcome into your tarot messages for today, Cancer. And we're looking at love messages. Thanks for tuning in. I hope that all is well with you. Like the video, share, comment, subscribe. Let's get into it. There was an energy of a hidden enemy that was jealous of you over a man. And this person was doing witchcraft on you this person could be a um a taurus or a pisces or a capricorn or a sagittarius and they were this could be like a woman that was jealous over a man and so she started to like try to do hexes and stuff toward you she was really jealous of you man or woman vice versa like for the mass if you are a masculine energy strongly you had a bad man just masculine energy around you that they had like all this vehement vibrations toward you in love jealousy it was so real and so strong and so vehement okay vile and they this person they really have nothing on you but they they would try to see it's like they they they, their energy would somehow come off as intimidating because they, they may be angry or aggressive or they try to like outshine you or outstand, outstand you in some way. Uh, maybe to try to intimidate you but it does not work and that also affects this person even more masculine. Feminine is, feminine is this energy of a woman. She's um, for, for feminine. It's the energy of a woman that is highly jealous of you. She may be, I hear, rational. Um, she, so she tried to throw spells at you to like affect you, break you down because she was really angry, really jealous and really caught up in her feelings. So that's the first energy. Whew. So the second energy is that there is someone that is highly crushing on you. They're so into you. This is a secret admirer. This is a new person. They think you are amazing. You're beautiful. You're so attractive. You're getting a lot of attention. You're compelling. You're mesmerizing. This person, they want to move toward you, but they don't know how to move toward you. They don't really know how to feel. They feel like you've done something to them. You've just won them over. Um, I hear victory. Like, if you were trying to get this person's attention, you've done it. That's the energy that this person has. Like, you have my attention. Okay? Getting an energy of, like, I hear daddy. And then I'm hearing that this per someone wants to take you home. And someone has been looking for you. You may be out here single, shining, independent, doing your own thing, looking radiant. Um, you're getting, you're just getting a lot of attention. You've had some type of a glow up. You're feeling good inside out. Kamehameha vibration powering up from the inside out, right? So what, there's something that whatever is yours is yours. Something cannot be taken from you or stripped from you anymore. Your confidence, your, your redemption, your liberation, your independence. This is something that you've made, you've built up within yourself, right? So I'm getting there was maybe an energy or a time where you needed to be built up because you like, and I feel like you, you took pride in doing the work on yourself. Now I'm feeling like someone wants to come around and invest in you. This person, they'd be looking for you. They, like someone wants to take you home is the energy I'm getting. Yeah, someone is missing you. The Knight of Swords is the first card. Someone is so sad and so missing you. I don't even know who this person is. A part of me is feeling like I don't want to talk about the past. I like I feel I felt really excited to dive into the future. I like I don't want to talk about this, but someone is really missing you. They feel really sad, regretful, remorseful for having lose you. I don't know what they said. I think they said something that may have backfired in some way and they ended up losing you this person they want to call you speak to you but they feel like they can't they can't get through to you there's no connection there's no communication with you and this person nine of swords could be a gemini libra aquarius this person could have even lied on you is the energy something that happened that they feel like they cannot take back Mm -hmm. But this person, Nine of, Wands, Knight of Wands, is wishing somehow that they could show up or arrive or get something back. They want to fight for you. They're also jealous over you, Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords and the Knight of Wands 
is what I'm getting. Someone is jealous over what you have or where you are, what you've accomplished, your fulfillment, your happiness, your not even happiness, but your where you stand now. Um, because it's hard for them to get through to you again is the energy. It's hard for them to be able to penetrate or come into you without having something to come forward with. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, someone is upset at that. Yeah, oh my god, the seven of ones. I hear grace. Someone is upset that they cannot trespass on you. They cannot um hurt your grace anymore, dimmer your light or hurt your shine or confuse you. Um and that isn't I don't know how you'll be taking this message. It sounds negative, but I still feel like you're not taking it negatively because you're still standing confidently as if you already are aware of what's been going on. And you are somehow prepared for anything that is to come. There is someone that wants to move toward you so badly. Right? So prepare for that. They are jealous. They are competitive. They are possessive. They don't want to see anyone else around you. Even though for this person, it's... So we are talking about a past person. Or just someone that is so in love with you, but they don't really know how to express that to you. They don't really like to see a lot of other people giving you attention. And there's something about your glory and your money. And there, there may have been a time where this person could gaslight you or those little low vibrational energies in order to be able to come back to you. But those things are not working anymore. So this person is feeling checked. They're feeling like, yeah, they're going to have to go do the work on themselves. You're probably not even speaking with this person or telling them what they need to do. It's just the energy that you're giving off is making them know that like I can't get my way I need to change so this person realizes that they got to change someone is also feeling very distant from you and they're just having a hard time not being with you and like smooching and all of these things okay yeah that's I was about to I was about to say that's the truth because looking at the nine of swords energy too it's truth so I know some truth is coming out and someone is coming to speak some truth to you. Some harsh truth, some real truth. Okay, someone may even want closure. Something, Someone has something to say. They feel defiant and they feel like you're not listening to them. So they're upset. Yeah, look, six of swords, another confirmation that someone is showing up or they're at least thinking about it powerfully. This person is thinking about when. When to show up because they've, they've already made their mind up. Right, and they are also sending other people to watch you and spy on you to see when is the best time. They may be spying on your social media, trying to get information on you. This person is determined to show up. They, there, there's nothing gonna back them down. They've, they've, they've built up the willpower. Okay, maybe at first their confidence was not very up. This person, they've built the confidence. So they just. <laughs> I like we could ask why this person is like I haven't seen one cops card but I guess this person is in love with you or obsessed with you coming to ask you out I'm telling you someone is showing up to ask you out and they want a yes they're not gonna take a no they need you to say yes is the energy someone is coming they want to level you up or they want to show you what they've been working on and all these things they've they've also been communicating with your family yeah they, i'm telling you this person is very possessive it's giving me possessive energy controlling they like to have what they want and it's you you're so attractive too. you king of wands energy you're so attractive it's like making someone so mad or, right and i'm just getting a strong past energy person a capricorn i'm getting a mother energy as well just someone feeling out of control they're gonna drive toward you move toward you in some way and i like i'm telling you they're sending they're also sending people before them to watch out for you or something yeah this person someone is also upset at something about your life and they want like the energy of someone wanting to make it better like they're upset about your state or your position so so they're not really upset with you they're someone is madly upset and they want to come and fix things or break you away or fix you or change you or level you up all right so when this offer comes in consider it in a high priestess someone just someone is so into you someone sees the real you 
someone sees the your 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 real value your real worth there's this energy of a person that is feeling that you're not being treated fairly they're upset about that and they want to come and break you free from something this person uh, is some type of a renegade energy all right i'm not even sure if this person loves you but they're really passionate about you maybe i, I don't know the hermit i hear drug someone did something the hermit secluded someone locked someone away betrayed them but bite them someone did something like that to you and you could be feeling stuck in love okay but i'm telling you there's a hand of might and of such a powerful love that is coming even without you realizing that it's coming to set you free okay mm -hmm. and i love you the fool card I don't know something is taking shape and form and i literally don't this full card is i don't i don't know what this is i don't know maybe someone is feeling a fool for letting you go for not choosing you all right someone was also pulling on your energy someone needed your energy and then you pulled away and they're not able to get their supply out of your energy anymore there were also people in your family that were betraying you but biting you stuff like that but you know let it fall you don't have to take it as heavy as it sounds 